Hello everyone, and welcome back to Paper Mario! Last time we got the second star spirit and made our way back out the desert, the dry dry desert. So, now, well, we're back in Toad Town, our central hub of operations, I guess. And I wanted to do a couple things before we headed over to the Forever Forest, which looks like it's going to be star spirit area number three. Uh, one of those was to go to the dojo, which is why I titled the episode accordingly. <laughs> Because we haven't been to the dojo yet, and the jokers in front of it are now gone, so we can actually go in there and find out what the heck is going on if I don't start hitting people in the head. Yay! Is it Jinx? Ah, probably not, but oh well. He, he wouldn't return until he was incredibly strong. Okay, well, let's see if, is he, if he is as strong as he claims to be. If I would quit hitting the wrong buttons. Uh, well, it's definitely not Jinx. <laughs> Hello? I love the the little background fighting the uh, sound effects in the back there. You must use, try many tactics. Well, yeah, I mean, because the same tactic is not going to work all the time. Let's see, each enemy, well, we know that. Sometimes you use your body, sometimes you use items, but you always, always must use your mind. Well, I'm in trouble on that one. Nah, I should be okay. Sometimes you'll be surprised. Well, okay, uh, who are you, ghosty looking thingy? Sometimes the best tactic is to not fight at all. You mean like against Go-Go in 5? Or in Final Fantasy 5, I mean. There's no cowardice in choosing to run away from a superior foe. Any such advice can also be applied to Smash. Yeah, that's true. See, you, let's see, you'll find some enemies that are impossible to escape. Okay, so basically don't be a wuss. Hi! Oh, you must be Mario. That'd be, you're the, you're the master. Not just the master, you're the master with the, uh, the, uh, capitals and everything. Uh, you sound like you're not doing so hot though there, master boy. Oh, please, pardon me. Okay, if your health is delicate, why are you not, say, retired or something? I don't know, just a thought. Let's see, if you have the purpose and desire, you may challenge us. Is that the royal we, or is that the I'm actually going to fight all three of you we? Then, oh, okay, that's the all three we. That's kind of what I figured. Now, Chan, it is time for you to fight Mario. As you say, Master. Okay. Alright, well, Mario! Here comes Chan the man. You look like a beetle. So, I'm not sure about the man part. Uh, okay, let's see. There we go. That'll work. Alright, let's see. How do you do there, Mr. Uh, I keep wanting to call him Shelder. I don't know. Or Sheldon. Mr. Cooper. That's who he is. Okay, is this going to work to turn you over? Yeah, it will. Okay. Oh, how dishonorable. <laughs> well, excuse me for taking advantage of your weakness. Alright. Let's see. Let's go ahead and just pile on the pressure here. Or I could totally miss the timing. Oh well. Still did what I wanted it to. Okay. Huh. I was sitting there thinking, I'm like, wow, is he done already? But no, not so much. Not quite, anyway. I'm guessing the next one's gonna be old Ghosty over there. That's my thought, anyway. Okay, let's see. Didn't he himself tell us? Yeah, he did! And then he calls us dishonorable for actually doing it. Okay, good, there we go. And, okay, no experience for doing this, but still. We get ourselves some good training. Yep, I wins. Chad, you must train harder. Betty, well, I give you this. Oh, cool, okay. I've got a first degree card, which I guess, I don't know if that does much, but... 
All right, well, you know what? Let's go ahead and smash you in the face. Let's go ahead and keep training. All right, let's try. Lee will fight you. Wait, we're starting to go Pokemon, aren't we? Because there's there's Hitman Lee and it's, it's reminding me of Pokemon names here. Let's see. Degree cards, degree cards just prove that you beat them. I, yeah, I kind of figure as much, but I thought I would just go ahead and try it just to start things out. Certainly, sir. I will defeat him, master. Okay. Sure thing. Bet you've never seen a move like this before. Not quite, no. I mean, okay then. So you transform into whatever companion I have. Gotcha. Oh well, that's fine. You also assume his weaknesses too, so let's take advantage of him. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I mean, that's the first thing that came to mind because I've been playing Pokemon so recently. Well, I mean, it was Pokemon White, so not that recent, but yeah, I figured. It's just the first thing that I thought of. Of course, then you've got Jackie Chan and obviously Bruce Lee. Oh, so that knocks you out of your tele. Okay, you you hurt. All right. And that was silly. I, I totally missed my cue on that one. These guys can be crippled. Oh, you are strong. I'll give you that. I bet you've never seen a move like this before. You gonna transform again? Oh, you're bomb at now. Okay, hi. Let's see. All right. Well, in that case, then. We've got to avoid doing, I guess, uh, immediate damage to her. All right, so jump, let's see. Actually, I think Hammer would be safer in that regard, I think. So does that mean you're gonna start? No, nope, never mind. you're not gonna start trying to explode. I wondered if you were, and then I was gonna have to toss Cooper at you. There we go, good. I actually got a decent timing there. <laughs> Okay, so does that mean you're going to... I figured when he said that he was going to transform back again, but I guess not. Oh, okay. I'll take it. So we win round two. Enough. Mario is the winner. <laughs> okay, so we get ourselves this secondary card. Okay, so... I'm just going to go out and save real quick because I'm going to come back in and I figure we're probably going to end up going after Mr. Master himself. But, you know, I'd just like to save my achievements for the moment, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I figure it's probably best just to make sure. I mean, I don't know if... Dang it, quit hitting the wrong button, Eric. I guess I, because I've been playing Witcher 2, I'm used to X being the action, the talk to people button now, so I gotta get back used to it being A again. Welcome to our dojo. Yep, I'm going to fight you, buddy. <laughs> Alright. Oh, and we get new music for it, too. Ha! <laughs> okay, then. I like the the music change with this. Hmm, excellent move. Okay, uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? Let's see, yeah, the shell power abilities are not really gonna be all that useful in this battle. Oh god, six, holy crap. Uh, yeah, there's another thing. You don't heal in between battles. I just saw that. I always think R2 is dodge in every action game. <laughs> yeah, oh, I know how that goes. I mean, I know, obviously, there's not much you can do insofar as trying to regulate what buttons should be where, un unless you give button mapping in every game, which most groups don't. Uh, okay. It's time to refresh a little bit, I think. Not that that's going to help me too much. I might end up having to use an item or two, but... Actually, in point of fact, I should have used an item first, now that I think about it. Used some of my FP before uh, using any specific item, or before using Refresh. 
Or I could actually get the timing right for a change. That would work, too. Okay, well... I mean, I guess I could go back to the desert anytime and get these if I wanted to. Although, in the scope of things, this probably was not a good use of an item. Ah, get the timing right, Eric! Okay, well, let's see. Okay, so that does the same damage, alright. Just thought I would check out and see if it actually would work better. Turns out it doesn't. You have natural talent. But I have a natural talent for missing the cues. Pfft. Wow. Okay, so the hammer is going to be the better choice. Probably should have charged it up too, but I mean, it's a little late for that now. Wonder how much HP this guy has. And I could bring Gumbario in to check, but by that time I'll probably be dead. Okay, thanks for telling me I have natural talent. That's better. Okay, I'm in danger mode now, so... Let's do another refresh here. I think he has 50 HP. Oh, wow. Okay. Hey, Alan. How's it going, man? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate it. Uh, we are fighting the master at the dojo, and I'm not doing so hot. But then again, that's because I keep missing my cues on my attacks all the time, so... And like that. <laughs> uh, well, you know what? I'm gonna give it a shot. I mean, I don't really think I'm gonna be able to do much else, but... Okay, excellent move then. I might need to come back later and do this. He's definitely beatable at this point. Okay. Plonk. <laughs> yeah, at the end. You lack strength. Okay, well. I guess we'll go get ourselves... Now, did that actually... No, it didn't, okay. It didn't rest us. I should have realized that, I guess, whenever we first went in. That it wasn't regening my HP. So, you have to basically go back to a toad house to get that done. Even though these are just, I guess, theoretical battles, so to speak. I still love how it just he just disappears under the covers there. I mean, I guess that is the key to a good sleep, but... Alright, let's save... Eh, actually, let's not do that just yet. Because, now that I've used all my items... Well, not all my items, but now that I've used one or two of them... Uh, this is actually... Alan, we're at the beginning of Chapter 3, I think. Because we just got the second Star Spirit, and we're about to start Chapter 3's events. Okay, so all I've really got is the regular Mushroom. Mm, that's unfortunate. Nah, yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, there's not really much I can get. But I'll go ahead and buy one. Uh, let's see. What items do I have? And how much room do I have for items? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, five, five. Well, I've only got room for one more item, okay. Meh, might as well. Okay, now let's go save again. But yeah, how are you doing, Alan? Are you having a, a good... Well, I guess it's still Saturday over in that neck of the woods, although not for too much longer. Well, actually, a little bit longer. Uh, but yeah, you having a good Saturday so far? I have, as you notice, adopted the face cam and adopted the Mario hat <laughs> for uh, probably the rest of at least playing through this game. I don't know. I mean, assuming I go through to uh, Thousand Year Door, I'll probably keep it there, too. Hello, sir. Let's try this again, shall we? Okay, so. 
to battle. Alright, first off, let me charge this up for a turn or two. I want to see if charging will actually be useful. Oh, and we, <laughs> we get a blessing too. Come on, attack. Okay, well, that's fine too. Especially since I utterly stink at blocking all of these. Alright. Yeah, I, um, I did change up the drivers, basically, and that fixed most of the problems. It didn't fix everything, but it did take care of most everything that was going on. There we go. Alright, good. Getting six damage. That's definitely better. Although, if that charge only lasts for one turn, it's not particularly worth... Ow. Uh, it's not particularly worth charging up, to be honest, because you lose the turn, and you only gain two in terms of attack points. So, yeah, it's not really, not really worth that investment, sadly. There we go. That's better. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I'll just I'll probably need to switch out charge for another ability, I would think. Okay, good. Alright, now I think would be a good time to refresh. We had a long day yesterday, so ew. Well, uh, I can understand, Alan. I'm uh, sorry that you had a long day yesterday. Uh, hopefully the rest of what you have for today will go a bit better for you. Does charge not stack? Uh, I don't know. I haven't really tried it more than one turn to see. I think I'll do so in a battle that has a little bit less import than this. Just to be sure. Oh, okay. Oh, that's fine. Let's see. Uh, it's also one well, enough. Okay. Two turns to deal double damage. Yeah. Although, to be fair, I haven't played a... I mean, I haven't played a Final Fantasy with a Dragoon very much lately, so I don't quite remember. Okay, good. I'm getting the timing a lot better. Okay, and uh, no. Actually, let me go ahead and refresh because I don't want to risk it. I don't know. There's just something about Mario being in danger that gets me nervous. Let's see. Should do some 15 miles on my exercise bike. Yeah, that's fine. Don't worry about it. See, don't think charge would be worth stacking. Yeah, I more, more, I just more want to test it just to test and see if it actually does stack. Oh crap, I missed my cue on that one. Son of a gun. Uh, well. Hmm. Alright, well, let's just start going to items, I guess, and have Cooper deal out damage in the meantime. Ah, and I keep missing the cues, too. I've got to be missing them by just a little bit here. And yeah, pretty much I'm going for broke at this point. I don't think this would work, will it? I don't know. We'll try. That did... Wow, nothing. And it didn't paralyze him. Okay. Well, yeah... Well, uh... Hmm... Gambario or Paracarry? Yeah, you're probably right, actually. I don't know, we might give it one more shot with one of those two. That's not what I meant to do, exactly. Or that. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I know, right? Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm going to go with Gumbario since he's powered up. 
because Paracarry is the only one of my companions that I haven't powered up yet, so. Alright, well, first off, let's heal before I forget. And quit using the dang X button to do stuff, silly. Or to try to talk to people. Boy. Again, like I said, Witcher 2. And then we'll give this one more shot and see if I can take down the master of the dojo. I figure if I can't take him down in this third attempt, then I'm just going to move on and see about getting stronger and then just take him down from there. Because, you know, three times is going to... It's a little much. Or if I go beyond three times, that's more than a little much. Uh, and I can't speed up the stairs, darn it. All right, you. Let's give this one last shot here. Okay, to battle. Alrighty. Okay, let's use the first turn with him to see about tattling, see how much HP he does have. This is the master. He owns the dojo, and he's the strongest member. Okay, yeah, it is 50 HP. Alright, so, yeah, at least we're, we know for sure now. And I totally stink again. Okay. Be curious, though, to see how close we end up getting here. Ah, and I... I keep hitting it. I know you're supposed to hit it right before he does the damage. But I keep hitting it before the moment before he hits the damage, which is probably why he keeps missing the cue. Like that. Okay, so... Might as well start healing myself again. Okay, so we got him in about half. There we go, that's better. Alright. Okay, so I'm free to go ahead and hit him again because even if he hits me for full damage next time, it's not going to kill me. Okay. There we go, good. Alright, so go ahead and charge ourselves back up here. And that'll have me at, what, nine? Yeah, okay. All right, so let's see. We might be able to pull it off this time. Possibly. All right. Um, I'll be honest. I might just end up having to kind of cheese this a little bit. Let's see. Actually, I could use the thunder <laughs> Thunderbolt. I don't know. And by cheese this, I mean use items to heal Mario and basically stall for time. Okay, so, let's see. Yeah, I'm totally going to stall for time. <laughs> Next turn, we'll be able to take him out, because he's only got 10 HP left. This should take him to 6 if I don't miss this cube, and I don't, okay. Alright, so, yeah, we should be able to take him out this turn. Well, third time's the charm, I guess. Okay, yeah, so this'll do it. Even just hitting him once will do it. Yay! <laughs> we finally win! By the hair on my chinny chin chin, mind you, but we win. Hmm, I see why you're so famous, Mario. Okay, give me the Master Badge, or third degree card. Okay, that works too. You're not going to be able to cheat him like this later on. Uh, I figure as much, yeah.
Okay, well, actually, while we're at it, let's go ahead and buy my mushrooms back while we're close to the store, and then we can move on. Yep, I, I, I think I've got a decent amount of coins, so yeah, I think I can afford to buy a couple of mushrooms. He has two other forms you can... Oh. Huh, okay. Well, I'll have to, uh, I'll have to keep that in mind, then. Whenever later comes around. I'm figuring you're probably looking at... I mean, if he's doing six damage now... Oh, boy. I, I, I'm a little scared to speculate. Let's see. I don't know when to fight the second one, but save the third for endgame. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Got it. Well, if I'm having trouble with him now, then I probably am going to have to wait a bit to fight the second one anyway. So probably like fourth or fifth star. Or star spirit. A uh, little bit of Super Mario RPG coming out there. Alright, so let's see. I think they said the Forever Forest was our next destination, so we'll go ahead and head over there. Alrighty, let's see. I don't think there's anything. Let's see. I wanna actually before that, I wanna go sprinting through Toad Town for a second. Just because I want to see if there's anything I can do as far as blocks are concerned. I don't think there is, but just want to check anyway. Okay, hello, port. How you doing? And you guys are just still sitting there fishing, which is unfortunate. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we can't do anything here. Alright. Oh, <laughs> oh, so that's all that is. Okay. Uh, yes, actually, I did hike over to the dry, dry desert. I just moved through that text a little fast. Noble soul by the name of Mustafa. Uh, yeah, we met him too. Yeah, we, we figured that out too. Secret surrounded this Mustafa. Mustafa is actually... No, I can't tell you! Well, that's that's alright. I'm not too torn up about that anyway. Alright. So, I guess there's not really much else for us to do then. Okay, that's fine. We'll just jaunt over here and ignore the creepy take two of your levels guy. Or give you two and take one or something like that. Ah! Uh-oh. Oh no, ghosties! <laughs> That's unfortunate. Ah, uh, yeah, I saw the ghost. I'm not the only one! I'm not crazy! Y'all, speaking of, hi! Go all the other way! <laughs> yeah, he's definitely there. My Mario, this madness has to end. I'm ashamed to say it's my job, but I just can't go. <laughs> okay, I guess we can help you. I mean, we are the heroes after all, so we might as well. Alrighty, so now let's officially go into this place for the first time. Although we did jaunt over here a little bit earlier. And that didn't happen last time. Hi. Pardon me. Do you have any grey poupon? But of course. Okay, who, who who's your master? Is your master the invulnerable guy that has a secret? Let's see, please call on us at the mansion on the far side of Okay. Gotcha. Also like to add that she has in her Okay, so not that one. Oh, Alright. Okay, sure. I'm not sure what you define as a warm welcome, but... Ah! And if you don't come with catch you... <laughs> Okay. I guess we have little choice but to oblige the thing. Yay! Chapitre 3! The invincible tubba blubba. Okay. Yay! Alright. Forever Force, both directions. 
all right, well, yeah, we've uh, been through here before a little bit. Figure we might as well go ahead and take each exit as they, oh my god. Okay, now I see the problem. Oh. Hmm. Okay. So the exits will basically, if you take the wrong one, it'll just take you in the wrong direction. And you have to go back. Oh, hi. Hmm. What do you think you're doing? I think I'm trying to find wherever I'm supposed to go. Let's see. How much attention... How much attention did you pay to the Switch conference? Uh, I didn't get to see very much of it. I just got to saw the got to saw the end. I just got to see the end of it because I was at work most of the rest of the time. So a little bit, but not very much. Uh, what are your thoughts on it, actually? Since you bring it up, enjoy the Lost Woods. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, didn't you know that? Uh, no, I'm not going back. Darn it. You're invited to Boo's Mansion. Oh. Okay. Listen carefully. I have to pay really close attention to your Sir Roll Lord. If you choose the wrong path, you'll end up back at the forest edge before you know it. Um, okay, yeah, I figured as much. Areas around the correct paths will always look slightly different from the others. Watch carefully for clues. Okay. For example, in this area, take a good look at the inner trees as you walk around. One of them will spot strange glowing eyes. The exit near that tree is the path you want to take. The clues will be different in other parts of the forest. Okay. Alright. So in other words, pay attention, Eric. Let's see, Nintendo's going to be charging for online now. Uh, honestly, to me, that doesn't mean much of anything. Because I'm so used to being with Sony that has always charged for online. Hi. That, I, I mean, to me, that doesn't mean much. So, I guess if you're accustomed to the, uh, accustomed to the services being free, then obviously that would be a huge difference. But to me, that doesn't really mean a whole lot. Keep forgetting the hammer's more powerful than my jump now. That's better. Oh, well, thanks for giving me my HP back. Appreciate it. Okay, so we're looking for glowing eyes. Whoop! Darn it. I hope to actually get the jump on it, but I guess not. Alright, well. This actually would have been a good level for Cooper's Power Shell, but oh well. Let's see. I was also expecting them to talk about their digital games. Oh, oh yeah. I, I can see where that would be a major problem. Because people have been so accustomed to the eShop that, yeah, I could see where that would be a pretty big issue. I I expect that if they, if they make it to where you do have to rebuy everything, I have a feeling Nintendo would lose a fair bit of support for their console. What the crap? Oh. You're gremlins! Except we don't have to get you wet for you to split apart, that's... Okay. <laughs> but yeah, if they made it to where... Hey, oh, well, sorry, you bought all these on the Wii U, but guess what? You gotta buy them again, boys and girls! Yeah, I, that would be a bad move. I hope they don't do anything like that. Yes, it would obviously get them more money in the short term, but it'd just be incredibly short-sighted. Okay, you should be able to take this guy out, I think. Yep, the end. Okay. Okay, so I'm looking for glowing... Ah, uh, oh, here we are. Hi. Alright, so you're the right one. Also, extra controllers are... Holy God! Man, that you're right about that. Whoa! Okay, so let's go ahead and take a jaunt around here. I'm just going to go around the circle and see what's different about this area, if anything. Uh, okay, we've got two flowers here. 
And we've got a path up. Uh, that's interesting. Oh, hi. How's it going? Yes, I know. I know. I know. Okay, so basically it's just him saying, hey, guess what? Okay, so I think the secret this time is going to be in regards to the flowers. Let's see. Okay. Uh, Alright, so you've got three there. They're all different, though. That's the thing. Because you've got one. Well, let's see. Let's take a look at the, the actual flowers on the bushes, then. Because that might be our difference here. Okay, so we got three here. We've got three there. Yeah, I think that's our difference on this one. Because all of these have three, except for this one that has four. So, I'm thinking that's our difference. Okay. Alright, now then. Whoop! No crap! Well, let's see. I can sort of understand the Joy-Con. Yeah, well, definitely. Especially since they're the ones that you can take with you. Top of basic button, controller buttons. There's also card reader, gyro controls, and some sort of... Uh, yeah, that is a lot of technology for a controller. I mean, I know the controller's intended to be part of the whole hybrid experience, but yeah, I can see where that would be an issue. Excuse me. Okay, so... Go ahead and slam you guys down on the turf here. Oh, hey, Duck Nuck, how's it going? Thanks for coming in. Welcome to a for Mario. With the hat and everything. <laughs> we uh, actually were just talking about the Nintendo Switch, so if you want to get in on the conversation, feel free. Eh, too early. Okay. Oh, way too late. All right. Eh, it's interesting trying to learn the timing on some of these attacks here. Oh. Okay, I missed my cube, it'll still take care of him. That's good. There we go. Nice. Alright. I figure it probably would be a bad idea for me to do any jumping on this one. So, I'm afraid I have to switch you out there, Goombari old buddy old pal. So let's do Bombat since she's powered up. Ah, darn it. That's too early, I think, on that one. Oh, yay! Oh, well, okay. Thanks. Not that I really need it on this one, but appreciate it. Just make sure he's dead, I guess. Is meh? Yeah, I'm not sure what to think about it either. Oh, say. Oh, yeah, Dragon Quest Heroes 1. Oh, that's good. Okay, so we've got creepy little tree face here. I think that might be our difference on this one. Let's see. Of course, I love how there's an inner path on... Oh, hi! What up, dude? Uh, no, talk to you. Hey, hello then! I'm a bubble! Yeah, we, we know what you are. <laughs> Should I give it to you or shouldn't I? Give me! Thank you! Yay! Please plant it somewhere nice. Oh, definitely. We're not gonna take care of it. We're going to have uh, Minty take care of it. And she's really good with that sort of thing. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I'm thinking Scary Tree Face is the giveaway on this one. Alright, you're not it. You don't appear to be it. Oh, no, you're it. You're it. You're it. I saw you, you sneaky bugger. Okay, so... Huh, okay, this one's gonna be interesting. As far as trying to figure out the difference. Okay, so... Whoa, hi! Nope, there we go. First time I've gotten a first strike this level, man. Or this uh, playthrough. This playthrough. This episode, rather. But uh, how are you doing today, Duck Nuck? Are you having a good Saturday so far? Alright, so I think Body Slam should be... The perfect recipe here. Ah, too early. That's better. Okay. And yeah, pardon if I look away from the camera at some points. The camera is perched on top of my laptop right here. 
And I'm playing, obviously, a little bit below it, so that might be why I look away at times. There we go. First Saturday off. In oh! Well, that's good. I definitely understand in terms of having Saturdays, or have not having days off very often. Yeah, I, I feel you on that one. So, I'm glad you got some little bit of uh, leisure time for a change. Okay, next, uh, next battle, I might need to just go ahead and... Okay. Hmm. Our difference in this one... Oh my god, okay. Lots of differences. You got tons of the little flowers there. Hey, how dare you! Nah, there we go. <laughs> Just hammer down on them until you actually... Holy crap. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead and hammer you for this turn at least. So that she can use a flower power attack. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Boom. Eat it, piranhas. Okay, good. Now I can use my refresh abilities and not feel bad about it. Oh, and what is this? Huh. Okay. Thanks. I mean, not that I really need the coins all that much, but I'll take them. Okay, oh man, this one's going to be kind of tough to figure out as far as the difference goes. So, let's see. Okay, we've got you. We've got you where the rocks are distant, but you've got about three of the flower thingies. We've got tons of flower thingies here. We've got three flower thingies here. Yeah, I think honestly that is the difference. Is most of them have three of the flower thingies. And then the other one has a bajillion of them. This one. Okay, still recovering from Holiday Rush. Oh, yeah. Oh. You, wait, you thought you saw... Oh, you did! What the? I have no idea what that did. I haven't the foggiest clue what that did. Uh, no. No, I didn't want to do that. Go away. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Let's see. Okay, so all those come on at once. All of those come on at once. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. Hmm. I'm still thinking this one's probably it. And if I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. I don't think I'm wrong, because... Okay. I just killed all of the flowers on there. Alright. Yeah, let's go ahead and use a couple of refreshes here. Just to get Mario all healed back up and stuff. Not that it's going to overly matter too much, but still... Alright, well this, let's see. At least you passed Master's exam. Oh, congratulations, man. <laughs> I have been through. I've been there. I know how it feels. It's a royal pain in the butt. But yeah, congratulations, sir. Definitely good. And you're going to create another gremlin. Okay. Uh, remind me what program you're in, Duck Nook. I've forgotten. Uh, shame on me, I suppose. But I guess that's what I get for being so concentrated with other stuff. Alright, uh, You know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and power bomb them. Take them all out at once, I guess. Then use another refresh in the next battle. Although, at this rate, I might actually want to refrain from refreshing. Uh, okay. Alright, let's go ahead and take you out since we've got the momentum here. Modern European history. Oh, okay. Did, uh... Ah, did you specialize in any specific... I mean, I know master's degrees, they want you specializing. 1700 to present, right. 
I uh, yeah, did you maybe do like French Rev or um, perhaps the end of the Habsburg dynasty with Austria Hungary or even uh, von Bismarck in Germany or I don't know. I just I'm being all history goofy, so don't mind me. <laughs> First, I know some people who... I know some streamers who are reluctant to disclose their, I guess, their programs to ensure that people don't, aren't able to figure out their, I guess, their real identities, so to speak. If you're not comfortable with it, don't worry about it. At... Ah, oh, okay. Ah, too early on that, I think. Alright, let's go ahead and do the refresh and just have uh, Bombette take him out. I know of the faculty that are here at Auburn, there's a few of them that do European, that do modern Europe. I know uh, Dr. Rohannon does France, for instance. And, uh, let's see. I'm trying to think who else. I know Dr. Justino does uh, Eastern European history. I don't remember exactly what era she focuses on, though. Okay. So, did we go back to the... Oh, well. Okay. Oh. Oh, hi. Well, then. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to use another flower power here. Because, man, four enemies on the map? I want to take them out quickly. And we're close to a level up anyway, so I might as well. Oh god! Ah, mash, 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 mash! Oh, that didn't kill everything, did it? Darn it. In fact, it didn't kill hardly anything. Wow, good job, me. Ah! Well, that totally worked against me. Oh well. We didn't really specialize. Okay. Yeah, I, I know, uh... Oh, God! Eric! Quit getting your abilities mixed up. Good lord. I guess it's a good thing that I am about to level up, because I'm just completely fudging up this battle. You say Victorian era? Okay. So you're looking at roughly 1800s Britain, then. That's an interesting period, because you've got a lot of... Because you've got a lot of byplay between, obviously, the whole idea of the Victorian morality. Oh, are you going to give me more experience? Oh, sweet! I'll take that, that's for sure. Especially because it gives me a level up. Yay! Okay, uh, I'm going to go with some more BP, I think. Because that seems to be vitally important in this game, at least from what I can tell. Let's see, also like World War One, World War Two, Interwar. There's really a lot to be studied in all of those. Yes, definitely. Okay, so, let's see. Let's go ahead and... Go ahead and look at the badges here. Okay, Power Jump, Smash Charge. Eh, yeah, I'm not a big fan either. Let's go ahead and take that one off. Then, let's see, Multi Bounce, Power Bounce... Quake Hammer. Oh, okay, that could be interesting. Let's see. God, so many... Jeez, so many badges. Best to remove charge and power jump. Yeah. I mean, especially since we've got Super Hammer. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Let you do a D-down pound. I have no idea what that even is, but let's try it. Then, let's see. Dizzy attack, spin attack... Hmm. I don't know. Let's see. We've got Hammer Throw. And let's see. Then Quake Hammer and other such things. Let's see. Multi Bounce, I think I'll take. And then I think I'll do Hammer Throw too, just to experiment. Let's see. Oh, well, yeah. Let's see. Disables an en enemy's defense. Ah, okay. Right. Alright, so let's see. Multi Bounce. Okay, jumps on all enemies in a row. All right. Okay, let's see. Jumps on one enemy continuously. Oh, that could be useful too. So yeah, let's actually... Hmm. 
I need more PP! <laughs> yeah, we'll go with these for now, see how well they go. I don't know if I need to have multi-bounce. Well, I don't know, multi-bounce hits a whole row, so that could be useful. Okay, yeah, let's go with this for now, see how it works. Alright, so now... Let's go back to our or our uh, trying to find the difference here in this one. Okay, so it looks like all of you guys have three flowers. And yeah, I think all of you do have three flowers, so I'm going to have to figure out another difference between you guys. I mean, you don't have the rock over in the side there. Y'all's rocks are right here. Uh, but that is also the case for you and for you, so... Okay, so you... Alright. I don't know, I'm thinking this one's likely gonna be the correct one, but I'm not sure. Let me check out all these flowers first. Okay, you fade away. You fade away. So we've got two of them fading away. Three of them fading away. This fourth one doesn't, though, so that might be the difference. Hmm. <laughs> well, let's try it. Okay, well, it doesn't look like it took me back to the beginning, so that's good. Whoop! Darn it! Alright, well, this seems like a perfect opportunity, actually, to go ahead and use... Not that. An immortality bone, sir. Oh, darn it. Okay, so you gotta keep the timing up. Alright. That wouldn't have been the right move anyway, so... Alright. Forgot how long this place was. <laughs> I know, right? Boom. Gimme. Okay, so... That was... The multi-bounce was kind of a... A little bit of a waste of FP. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Let's see. If you have business at Boo's Mansion, come this way. Uh, I don't trust that, really. Darn it! I was trying to get ready to do the freaking... Anyway. Um, uh, eh. Let's see. Jump on one enemy continuously. Okay. Eh, let's do Hammer Hammer. Alright, and then go ahead and Power Bomb. So, yes, I'm being more... I guess... I, I'm being more profligate with my action commands, or with the flower power, just because I want to get through some of these battles a little bit quicker, and get through this high forest. Okay, yeah, this looks like this is not going to be any sort of trick, so, okay. I guess we have reason to believe the sign. Yeah, I guess we have reason to actually believe the sign. Alright. Well, I was correct in thinking that we would have a heal spot. <laughs> I'm glad I was. <laughs> I couldn't stand being in that spooky forest! Mario? Let's see... Old mansion. Yeah, that would be this mansion. I mean, it certainly looks scary enough, that's for sure. <laughs> okay. Slam that door shut behind us. Hello, old Jeeves. Welcome, sirs and madam. I'm pleased you made it through. Okay. The room highest up in this... Wait, didn't they make Luigi games about this sort of thing? Please go to the third floor. Okay. Uh, Alright, sure. Why not? I'll see you then. Okay, but first I want to go back out of this gate just to make sure I didn't miss anything. I don't think I did, but... I thought you'd call him Genie. <laughs> Yay, Volt Shroom! Okay, not that I see myself using that too much, but... Yeah.
And yes, I'm being a I'm being a little facetious with that comment, Fez, because I did watch through I chug his playthrough of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. So yeah, I was aware of it. Alright, let's go ahead and skirt around. Yeah, let's save and go around the back. Since it's telling me to go to the third floor, let's go anywhere but the third floor. Okay, I noticed there was another little pseudo warp panel. Oh, hi. I'll take that. A very rare leaf. Uh, yeah, for that, I will get rid of the Tasty Tonic. Hello. Unfortunately, those aren't any good right now, so, I mean, I expect that'll happen later, probably. Oh gosh, uh, okay. You can't. Pfft. Well, never mind then. I guess that's what happened, or that's where we go after we get done here. Oh well. It's worth a shot anyway. Okay, interesting. Let's take a look around the place. Get some very spooky vibes here. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, can I play on the couch? Uh, whoa! Holy crap, it actually does something! <laughs> wow. I was just sitting there just piddling around, but you know what? Fine by me! No, not good! Okay. Huh. How then, pray tell, am I supposed to get there? Or am I supposed to keep that thing? I guess secured. Well, let's go through here first. Oh god, what? Well, excuse me then, princess. Let's try this again, maybe? Hmm. Oh, okay, it'll just automatically pull me back off. Alright. Well, in that case, I suppose let us continue on. Hi. Hi. Can we fight you? And hello, uh, rich uncle ghosty bags. Oh, I can't check the visitor's log, boo. Hello. I want your treasure. I'm so bored. Bored. Oh, boo. Lady Bow ordered me to... Okay. All right. Well, I guess we just go up to the top then, I suppose. It doesn't look like there's much we can do in these rooms otherwise. Okay, uh, well. Ow. Ha! <laughs> nice. So if we choose the wrong one, we get flattened. Oh god, hi. Mario, you have come! Do you want this record? Oh, God! Oh, no! The Lady Bow will be very angry if we let him get it too easily. Okay. Do your best like we practiced. Oh, God. Alright, so there's eight of you. Okay, what am I? Oh, there you are. Alright, so you are... That one. Oh, son of a... Oh, now I've got to choose? Oh, man. I thought I had it counted right. <laughs> well, excuse me, then. All right, so you've got it. All right, you're right there. Okay. Oh, no. There you go. No, boo hoo. Hee hee hee. Well, I would have gotten it the first time if the screen draw 
when the screen drew away, if I hadn't gotten distracted by that, I probably would have gotten it the first time, actually. Oh, well. Good day, booze. Give me that record. A record of upbeat music. How can you play this? I have no idea. I guess we'll find out. I could play it at the cafe, actually, now that I think about it. That might be where I'm supposed to play it. Let's see, is this one going to follow me too, I guess? Yeah, that one will probably fall on top of my head. So, out we go. Ah. Oh, hi. Uh, what are you so twitchy about? Yes, I, I would like to go to the third floor, thank you. But I'm afraid you'll have to go find whatever's missing from this frame. Okay! <laughs> Bow is such a harsh boo, testing your guest. Well, I'm expecting what is missing is probably that boo on the first floor. Because he's just sitting there at the door going, hey. But, I don't know. Oh, now we can go in this room. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Well, I mean, there's nothing to... Nothing to blow up. Not really. Let's try it anyway, though. Okay, that won't blow up, so... Alright, let's see... That, I don't think that's really going to help much. That will help even less. Uh, well. Oh my god! <laughs> nice! I'm glad they've got this little uh, cameo like they did in uh, Mario RPG. <laughs> hmm. I don't know, though. I'm not really sure what to... Oh, and he won't carry me. Boo! <laughs> okay. Let's see. I can't jump on... Nah, I can't jump on top of that thing. Oh, well. Sitting there going, wait a minute, can I jump on top? No. Let's see. Oh, that's not gonna help. Okay. Well, I can't push these, can I? No. Huh. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do in here, if anything. Of course, it's telling me to try to find what's missing, so... Let's see. Oh, oh man! I was sitting there thinking, I'm going, well, maybe it actually will stay Mario as I go out the door, but not so much. So, I guess I gotta figure something out in regards to this, don't I? Hmm. Okay, well, let's take a look around and see if I can figure this out here. Okay, we've got Uncle Pennybags there. We've got... Alright, and I can't jump on the pull chain from this. So... Hmm. I figure the answer is going to be fairly obvious once I figure it out. And then I'll feel stupid for not figuring it out earlier. Okay, of course if we pull this, it's going to open up that secret door. But I don't know that that's going to do much good. Because we can't get to it in time. Is once we step off of here, the door goes away, and we can't get to it. Although, let's see about something here. Now you can't get to it in time, okay. So that's not going to be it then. Hmm. There's nothing in here that's really in any way extraordinary. Okay, 
Okay, no, that's not gonna help. <laughs> hey, what can I say? I'm a, uh, I'm a sucker for repetition. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out the secret to this, uh, what I'm supposed to do as far as trying to find... Uh, trying to find the solution to that puzzle, but... I don't know. Maybe... Regular Mario holds the secret? <laughs> do much of anything. Can't do anything, actually. Unfortunately. It won't even pull up the item menus, wow. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna be the solution to anything. Yeah, I think we've gotta have uh, Paper Mario to do this. Yeah, what I'm thinking I have to do... Let's see... Okay, let me bring out Cooper for a second. I'm not sure he can do anything with this, but... No, that's not gonna do it. Okay. No, that's not it. Okay. Wait, what? Oh. Alright, let me bring out Goombario and see. Uh, no, I tried her, I tried that, but I don't think it works. Maybe I didn't plant her right in the middle of it, and that might have something to do with that. This room does have a lot of space, but it's still a shame to use it for storage. That pot in those wooden boxes looks suspicious. <laughs> okay. Well. I mean, I don't know if Bombette would be able to blow anything up, but... Let's see. Okay, yeah. She can't blow that up. Okay. Yeah, blowing it up doesn't seem to be the answer on this one. Hmm. I know under this chandelier is not really going to be the answer because we can't do anything with it. I don't really remember this part. Okay. Let's see. It says look under the chandelier. But it doesn't really seem to be yielding anything, and I don't think... Now, we can't push the blocks, so that's not it. Going, going uh, old school Mario, I don't think is going to do anything either. It's just a little... Uh, I think it's just a little... Extra Easter egg, I suppose. Now, Bombette, why you gotta go steal the show here? It's the Mario Show. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, I'm not really sure, to be honest. I'm kind of stumped on this one. <laughs> Okay, let me try this one more time, just to make sure on Bombette. Okay, no, that's not blowing up for anything. And then these guys... Huh. I don't know, maybe... Bring Goombario back out here, just to go into the hall and see if he'll give some information here. What a magnificent mansion! <laughs> The old-fashioned yet eerie style. Well, yeah, they certainly do, don't they? Even the sofa in the foyer looks pricey. Okay, well. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go back and talk to the painting. 
Did I explore the rest of the place? I mean, yeah, I've been in every other room that I could access. Because you've got this room where we had the uh, treasure chest guy. And then, well, actually, we can play the record here. You gotta have, oh God. I'll go through one full rendition. I think the idea is to pull him away from pull him away from the treasure chest. And so that we can go and grab it. I thought it said if you pushed B it would stop the recording. Here we go. Oh no! <laughs> She's gonna punish me so bad if she finds out about this! I may st uh oh. Not like you can get anywhere without knowing how to use that weight. Well screw you too then, boo. I think I know what to do here. Okay, let me just... I don't think there's anything to this room, because I think we've already done it, but... Yeah, because we had to get the record to be able to do that part with the weight. Now, we got to go down here with the weight. And... <laughs> I know, right? I think we got to train the weight on this thing to keep the door open. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know if it'll allow me to. And if not, then I know what else to do with it. Oh, here we go. Yep. There we go. Alright, so... Oh, it can't be that simple. There's no way it could be that simple. Any treasure chest just sitting there? No, thank you. Okay, so... Huh. Well, I figured we could check the grandfather clock, but I guess not. What is in here, I wonder? Or out here? Or... Oh, hi. More boxes. Oh, wow, this mansion, there's a lot more to it than I thought there would be. And yet another floorboard, alright. Holy cow, super treasure chest. Oh, God! More! We gotta do it again! Oh, and whatever that is. Mario Manikin! The boots, okay. <clears throat> Hi there. Okay, so I'm guessing this one's gonna be a bit tougher than the last one. Alright, so you're in... Oh god, yep. Okay. Alright, so you are... That one. Ha! Screw you two, Boos. The Super Boots! Ah, oh, okay. Now we can do spin jumps. Sweet. No, boo-hoo! You did it a lot easier than last time. Uh, yeah, y'all are pretty much screwed. <laughs> Bye bye, booze! Alright, so. Oh, hi, you suddenly pop up there for some weird reason. Yeah, there we go, hi! What's up? There's a hidden floor panel very near here. Oh, okay. Boost of luck! Ah, not that one. There you go, hi! Hidden panels on the ground all over. Oh, oh, Lord. 
So I was just may sit here uh, double and triple jumping the whole way. And suddenly I can't. Interesting, okay. They just, they got rid of the exit. Which means they force you to do this. <laughs> so an explosion won't destroy. I guess not. Oh, it's a P-Switch. And a shop. Hi. What's up, shopkeeper? Lady Balmy told me not to sell any items to Mario. Oh, uh, well, whoopsie. Yet, they're still listed here, so... Oh, God. Oh, what the... <laughs> okay. It's... Oh, God. Well, I meant to do the jump off of there, but uh, that didn't work out so well. It's a jump time! Oh, okay. Thanks. That looks like a pretty ni pretty nifty item shop. Alright, that's not gonna do any good, okay. Alright, well. Thank you for giving me the exit or the entrance back here. Okay, well, now that we've done that, I don't feel so bad about opening up the treasure chest upstairs. Whoops, that's not quite what I meant to do. I also did not mean to get stuck. Nah! Okay. So did that actually hurt me? Feels like something is watching us. Oh, joy. Feels like that everywhere. <laughs> it's almost as though this haunted mansion is haunted. Gee, really? Who'd have thunk it? Uh, let's see. I was checking to see if it actually took my HP out. It did not. Alright, so that treasure chest there was a red herring then. Okay. So now that we've gotten that... Let's go ahead and a jump! Oh lord, we're uh, somehow on top of the library. Okay, I didn't realize there was a library around these parts. Well, that's nice. Okay. Alright. Nope. Paracarry, I think I need you to fly me around a little bit here. No. No! Down, you silly thing. Thank you. Gimme. Boost. There we go. That's what I was looking for. And hello. Potentially hidden floor panels? No. Okay. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess if you wanted to get back down there. I don't know. We're watching him. Yeah, I know, right? Let's see. Mario's got a feeling. It's oh. <laughs> Speaking of, apparently one of the lessons we learned this week, uh, aside from the Nintendo Switch, is going to be a, an intriguing little console, if nothing else, is don't don't play Michael Jackson if you're a white guy, because now we've got controversy stirring up about that. Alright, so we solved the puzzle. Get back on there, Boo. What are you? Teddy Boozevelt? I mean, my goodness. Oh, that feels better. <laughs> okay. Alright then. Yep, you uh, help me go up there, please. Jump toward the drawing and I'll take care of the rest. Okay. Jump toward what? Oh. You mean you. Okay. Thank you. Say hello to Bao for me. I will, I will. But I'm going to explore first. Oh, and you can just fall right off. Alright. Oh, never mind. This was the right room, I suppose. Whoops. <laughs> you finally arrived. Yes, yes I have. And yes, I did kind of take my sweet time. If a green onion were a hip-hop artist, would it be a rap scallion? <laughs> Teddy Bella, Teddy Boozevelt. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I was just testing you to see if you live up to your reputation. Well, I, eh. I mean, it's okay. Took me a bit to figure it out, but... Oh, hi. Lady Boo, or Lady Bow. 
and Jeeves. Yo, Bootler. <laughs> never, never mind. I still kind of think Jeeves might be a better name. <laughs> okay. Well, that's good. Reason I asked you here. Okay. Well, sure, we can help you out, I think. You want us to get rid of what's his name? Give him the rundown. Okay. Of course, my lady. Mario? Do I know? Uh, not yet, no. Hill rises at the top. Yep. Tubba blubba. He's a monster. And he eats us! Goosed! Boos are his favorite. F oh lord. Wow. Okay. He's got a bit of a spectral appetite then. Tubba Blubba is far too strong for his booze. Uh oh. Okay, so what do we do then? He seems invincible. Well, we saw at the beginning of chapter 3 that it was invincible, so. And of course, they mentioned that he has a secret. The rumors are true, then Tubba Blubba has a secret. Okay. And that secret is probably something that relates to his weak point. No kidding, really. Hey, I'm fine with that. Go right ahead. I'll definitely go after him. We'll do it, won't you? Of course, you'll get a re Well, that's good. I mean, rewards are always nice for adventurers. If you beat Tubba Blubba up, I'll let you have this. You have a star spirit held captive? Really? Huh. Wow. Why does Bootler have a mustache on his forehead? I don't know. My name is Scholar. Oh, well that's unfortunate. I was in quite a weakened state. Oh, okay, well. So she put you in prison. Nope. <laughs> hey, that's okay. I know how easy it is to become lost in that forest. Oh, a poor thing. No, it's not really a bad deal, but you shouldn't have captured him in the first place. You would have had to fight him. Well, yeah, I mean, that was the idea anyway. Let's see. Might want to practice jumping out of your spins. Ah. Uh, okay. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, sure thing. My lady! Oh, I see what you mean now with the mustache on his forehead. You a tub of blubbers? Quite out of the question. I simply cannot allow you to put yourself in such danger. Excuse me. Okay, so she's gonna be one of the good guys then. Alright. Well, sort of. I mean, she's got that thing captive, so... A eh, little ambiguous there, but... Okay, uh, sure. What sort of powers are you talking about here, Chickadee? Then I, Bootler, will accompany you. Oh, well, you mean all the other booze that have been eaten up? Uh, wow, okay, apparently she's got a mouth on her. Who knew? I'm not a child anymore! Well, you won't be by yourself, you'll be with us. Okay, so... Apparently we have ourselves a new companion. We have Bao! Like it or not. <laughs> okay. Oh! To have her make you both be transparent so that no one will notice you. Huh, okay. She can slap enemy silly with her smack attack. Or use out of sight. Okay. Interesting. That could be useful for healing purposes, if nothing else. 
she's very good against single targets. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Huh. So let's see. You mean I'm supposed to be practicing that? Oh! I, oh, so both doors went into her place, so it didn't matter which one I took. Okay. Whee! Oh, hi. What's up? Yeah. Okay. I prefer, I prefer to say bow, like crossbow. I don't know. I mean, it's... I guess you really could do either one. Not that that even really wasted much in the way of health or MP, but or FP, but might as well save anyway. Go ahead, all up in it. Uh, hey guys, I didn't realize that. What the? Why did everything suddenly change colors? Oh, because we're going to uh, Dusty. Dusty Gulch, or Gusty Gulch, or something. No, I'm not scared. What are you talking about? Oh, <laughs> hey. Um, I guess... I'm not sure whether I should call you Other Alan, or Allender, or... Now that we have both Allens in here for the first time. Uh, hi. <laughs> How's it going? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in. How is your Saturday going so far? Okay, did that actually... I oh, guess not. All right. Ah, here we go. Now we can use our super jump. That's better. Well, yeah, but we've got I've got two Allens, so that's why I ask. It's definitely. <laughs> oh God. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Wow. That's I screwed that up totally. What the crap are you doing? Are you going Super Saiyan on me? That could be interesting. And I will take my star points, thank you. But uh Okay. Oh! There we go, good. Well, well, that took your wings real fast. In that case, then I'm jumping on the other one. It's interesting with the extra little, the extra oomph for that jump there. There we go. Well, ah, uh, Fez, I see what you mean now in regards to her being much better against single enemies. Ah, crap, I screwed up the timing. Whoopsie. tough to manage. I'm not sure why. Oh, God! Wow! So, yeah, definitely kill him before he goes Super Saiyan on you. Holy crap. You gotta enunciate the second syllable. Alon! <laughs> Alright, you. Oh, crap. These guys were meant to teach you. Oh, yeah. Fair enough. Ah, darn it. Well, that would have been useful, actually, if I'd pulled that off. There we go. Okay, so now everybody's going to go Super Saiyan. Oh, Lord. I can definitely see what you mean as far as teaching us here. Let's see. That's true. My name where I live sounds different from what... Okay. 
Okay, so it'd be more like Alan, I guess. See, I remember Bao using five smack five times, huh? Maybe that's a later iteration of it, I suppose? I don't know. Uh, anyway, let's see if... Oh, wow, good job, me. Okay, yeah, definitely need to get us out of sight here. Yeah, I know we're, our pronunciation is so accustomed to being that we emphasize the first syllable so much. Probably a little too much sometimes, but yeah, so I could, I could definitely see where you're coming from on that one, though. Okay, good. So y'all are just using normal attacks now. I can take that. I can handle that. So... Oh, here we go. Okay. Wow, how are you not... It's good to see that you got your normal attacks are just as normal as any of the others I've seen. Okay, so maybe what I'll end up doing is... Um, Mr. Bakuth, you can stay Alan, and Alan, I guess I'll just pronounce it Alan. How about that? Since you're saying that's pretty much the right pronunciation of it anyway. Okay, so we need a key, and we don't have it. I hope we'll get one later. Just start singing Toccata and Pew. I... I... <laughs> I've heard the name, I just don't remember exactly what that is, actually. Oh, hi. Who are you? Oh, Lady Bo! Bow! Whatever! You really shouldn't come around- well, too late now. Toba Kablubba could come here at any moment! Well, that's kind of why we're here, to you know, take care of him. So yeah, it's time, I guess. Bring him on! When was the last time he came through here? Oh. Oh, okay, so apparently he does visit often then. This time he ate Herbert. <laughs> poor Herbert, rest in peace. Oh wow, he did say poor Herbert. He was so dark and <laughs> Oh, the poor guy. This close to what your name really sounds like. Okay. That monster has eaten his last boo meal. All right. You know he's called the Invincible Tub of Lava. <laughs> All right. So you got any more information? Don't fight. Okay. Someone who claims to have no weaknesses must have at least one. Well, yeah, I figure so. <laughs> yeah, Fez, get fired up. We need that emphasis, or we need all that. Uh, we need all that power. Let's see, did you know you can walk slowly and stealthily by moving the control stick a little bit. Okay. All right. Well, I'll have to keep that in mind then. Apparently, there's nowhere we can go for. Okay. Oh, hey, no. Oh, oh okay, it's just one. All right. Huh. Well, yeah, I figured that out already the hard way. Best thing to do when they get charged up is get out of sight with Lady Bo! Okay, so I'm guessing what they mean is just... Hi. Let's see, I had a friend who escaped from Tub of Lobo's castle. The key to solving a secret is in the inside the innermost room. Pay attention to both the heart and body and don't... <laughs> Don't get eaten. <laughs> okay, so in the innermost room, pay attention to the heart and body, and don't do something. Okay. Yay! Gimme. Alright. Oh, hello! Boo, I guess. <laughs> Alright. Sometimes you must turn and run away. You must run and run until you reach the tower with the spinning... Whoa, okay. Something like that. 
Ah, uh, okay. So we're getting these hints here, I guess. Wait, your friend escaped from Tubba Blubba's too? Okay. Well, apparently a lot of people are able to escape from this place. Even the Star Spirit, so... He might be invincible, but this castle certainly isn't. Gosh, I'm not sure I'm going to be able to remember all this. Hey guys, what's up? Not all of that. Yep, that's why we're here. That's the plan. Yeah, get revenge! Especially... Oh, Lord. Uh, yeah, I think he's here. Oh, no! Okay. Oh, hi. There's no way Tubbo Bulba can see you right now. <laughs> uh, that's not gonna help there. Oh, no! Chomp. Well, bye, ghosty. A little tangy, but... Wait a minute, what are you, Bellwom? I mean, seriously. You're gonna start spitting out clones next time I look. Frank. <laughs> Stanley! <laughs> no, Stanley, no! Oh, the horror of it all. So, if you're Stanley, uh, what does that make you, I wonder? <laughs> okay, so... So you're avenging, avenging Herbert and Stanley. Uh, I don't know. If this is Stanley, I'd be tempted to say this is Leanne, but I say that simply because I have an uncle named Stanley and an aunt named Leanne, but... You clearly look like a dude ghost, so I don't think Leanne's gonna work very well as a name. Okay, anyway. Thank you. Dang it, really? Oh, good lord. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, definitely no jumping on you, that's for sure. Okay. Should get the Stanley Parable. Oh, yeah, that one, uh... What is that one about? Uh, I think I'm getting it mixed up with Talos Principle. Because I know Talos Principle, I think it was a puzzle-type game. Okay. I don't think Smack's going to do much, is it? Let's see, also the other game of its creator. <laughs> Nah, it ain't gonna do a thing. Okay. Well, it's worth a shot. Ah, right. Yeah, okay. That's the one y'all were talking about. I, I guess a couple of episodes ago now. Alright, you. We gotta switch you out here, because you ain't gonna do much. Uh, we're probably gonna have to go with Bombette, I would expect. Although, I don't think she'll do anything either. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, let's just keep on hammering... Hey, ghost! Or spirit thingy. Okay, that's good. Definitely needed that. That'll take care of you. Actually, oh yeah, that's right, because that ignores defensive stuffs. So, yeah. Man, it'd be nice if my brain would work on occasion. Okay, well, Cooper, this is probably you. Or, I could totally miss. There we go. Thank you. And, let's see... Actually... It's not really... Let's see... Dazes and paralyze all enemies briefly. Hmm... hmm. I, I'm not really... I, I don't want to keep this one, to be honest. I go to all the trouble to pick it up, then I get rid of it, so go figure. Okay, well, we need to switch over to Chickadee for you. There we go. Let's see. What do I usually... Oh, did that actually hit? No, I guess not. Uh, let's see. What do you usually like to play or are planning to play in the future? Um, Alon, I am primarily a... I, I do primarily RPGs. 
because when you see this here and I'm doing the the JSRPG <laughs> two shape those. Uh, <laughs> I do I'm doing this right now and I'm playing Final Fantasy V at the moment as well. Uh, as far as games that I'm gonna be playing after I get done primarily after I get done with FF5, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be playing uh, let's see. I'm not sure in which order I'm going to be playing these next three games, but I'm going to be playing uh, Super Metroid, one of the GBA Castlevania games. I'm not sure which one yet. And also, uh, let's see, what else was I was wanting to play? And I was wanting to play um, Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. So I'm going to be playing those three games. Like I said, I'm not sure which order I'm going to play them in yet, because I just don't, I'm not sure. But, those three games are going to be coming next. Oh, and thank you for the follow, Supersonic Man. Appreciate it. You sort of snuck in on me. So, I'm going to be playing those games in some order or another. That's going to be after I finish Final Fantasy V. Because after I get done with this game, I think I'm going to go ahead and move on to Thousand Year Door. I'm really liking this one, and I've been told by a few folks that Final Fantasy... Or not Final Fantasy that uh, Thousand Year Door is even better than the original, so... Okay, you're Super Saiyan. Going Super Saiyan again. Lady Bones. <laughs> well, hi! Yeah, it, she's fun so far. She's definitely good. Alright, that should take care of you. And... I'm going to take a chance on the idea that Smack is going to get rid of this one. Okay, good, it did. Or did it? Yes, it did, good. Okay. Let's see, Super Metroid before the Castlevanias. Not sure if I want Majora's Mask first or last. Oh, I understand. Like I said, i really not sure what I'm going to do on the on those. I got the Repel Gel. Huh. Okay. Let's see. Ugh. Well, okay. I like my FP restorations. I obviously like my HP restorations, too. Let's see. That's going to attack all enemies. That'll flip shell enemies. And Okay. Hmm. It's a tough choice, actually. Too bad that there's only ten... Only ten items that I can carry. Repel gel is basically bow without bow. Okay. Or bow without bow. Okay. Oh. Uh, yeah, I mean, guess it basically for free uh, FP, I suppose. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm going to get rid of the Vault Shroom. I mean, Voltrum, I guess, is a good item, but having the ability to just completely just take care of any damage. Oh, okay. Alright, so I've got to remember to deliver that letter soon. Dang! Not again! Alright, well, screw you two, then. Okay, let's see how the D-Down Pound works here. Let's see. Oh, okay. There we go. Yeah, that's much better, actually. Let's see. Okay, spicy... I'll have spicy snacks. Yeah, that's fine. And thank you. I appreciate it. But yeah, just, you know, come in whenever. I If some of those games you're not a big fan of, that's fine. Uh, others, yeah, that's fine, too. I mean, hey, whenever you're able to come in, I'd appreciate it. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Thought you escaped the lines when you... Yeah, fair enough. Okay, so let's see. All right, let's make sure this actually hits. And yeah, what I'm doing in regards to... What I'm doing in regards to the attacks for bow or bow is... I am actually actually hitting the left stick with my right hand just to make sure that I hit it enough for it to be successful. Okay, you guys though, whatever, big deal. Let's 
Odyssey. What were your impressions on Mario Odyssey? Uh, I haven't seen any of it, actually, so I have no impressions. <laughs> I know, at least just from what I saw as far as Twitter reaction, is Twitter was freaking out because it's Mario in a modern city. And I think the, the funniest thing I saw so far was a comparison to Sonic Adventure. As far as, well, what happened the last time a mascot or a, a, a Nintendo character was in a modern city and then you get Sonic talking to whoever it was? Let's see. And yes, I definitely agree, uh, you talking about Ace Attorney. I've not played any of them, but I have seen Nintendo Capri Sun play through a few of them. So, I've, I got some experience with it, even though I haven't played them. Did I actually get the first strike in? Not really. Okay, so, let's see if I can do this multi-bounce here, hopefully. Nope, I totally screwed up. Wow. Okay, so this could be terrifying. Ah, charge it up! There we go. Okay, let's see. If Mario lives up to the claims of being open world like Mario 64. Let's see. Yeah, it could be, actually. Okay, uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can do this again. Oh, God, are you serious? <laughs> oh, I'm awful at this. Okay. Well, might as well smack you around, I guess. Okay, so now you're all going Super Saiyan, alright. Let's see. I think with games like Ace Attorney being LP'd. I can understand where you're coming from on that. Because with the fact that they're visual novels, and them being LP'd, in essence, if you've seen it once, then that's it. I mean, you don't need to see any more. There's no real replayability for it. That's not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Okay, let's see. Yeah, pretty much the same thing. I, so yeah, like I said, I can understand where you're coming from on that. Okay, and I think now might not be a bad time to do a refresh. Because I've got this star power already built up. Might as well heal with it. Of course, one thing I haven't done, actually, is I haven't used Lullaby yet. And also, while I'm thinking about it, something else. If you use her ability, uh, Bo's ability, does it steal one of her turns? I mean, because I notice she's not attacking in the turn after she uses that. So, nah, that's still, I think, well, it didn't kill him, actually. Yeah, I tried to use my left hand to, uh, to do that. You can see it didn't work nearly as well. Okay, oh, oh, God, there we go, that's better. <laughs> Oh, dear, you're going Super Saiyan. Okay, well, fortunately, you don't have that much strength left in you, so I think we should be able to take care of you easily enough. Yeah. That's better. Okay. I wonder how much more of this place we have left. Oh, again! Alright, so, definitely D-Down Pound time. And I'll have to switch Bo out for this one, just because... She's not going to be able to hurt anything. Um, I don't know really that any of them are going to be able to, to be honest, though. Huh. Well, getting a little better at the timings of all this, eventually. 
I see. Pretty certain out of sight makes her... Okay. Yeah, I mean, I understand that. It's, I think, a useful idea. idea. Yeah, so she's not going to be able to hit him. Alright, in that case then, let's go ahead and kill you. Alright. And we get more experience. Nice! I'll take that. Thank you very much. Yay! That's the second time this episode that that's happened. Holy cow. Okay, so that was just there for me to fight you. So now... Alright, Paracarry. I need your assistance, please. And Bo, please come back out. So that we can fight you. <laughs> I know, right? Alright, we'll get you out of the sky at least. Well worth every penny. You're not kidding. It looks like, as far as the, the Hyper Goombas, if the first one doesn't power up, then none of them are going to. And if the first one powers up, then they all power up. That's just the way it looks to me, anyway. Maybe I'm wrong on that, but that's what I'm seeing so far. Oh, man, I missed the timing. Whoopsie. There we go, that's better. Alright, so... Oh, oh, Eric. Oh, man. That was dumb of me. Oh, well. I'll just have to smack you around, then. And... I think I can take you out before you... Uh, before you're able to attack us. So, I'm gonna bank on that. Yeah, I did. Good. Okay. That's good. Okay, so... Oh, Lord. Hi. Well, Super Shroom will replace regular Shroom. Or, let's see, actually, what I could do... Might as well go ahead, I mean, if we're going to be using a Shroom anyway, we might as well do this right. Yeah! No, grab her! Grab! Grab! There we go. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> Finally got a first strike on you, you goofball. Not that it means anything, but... Hey, at least it keeps me from getting struck, anyway. Okay, you gotta smack that one around. There we go, good. Okay, and... Block. Yeah, it's looking like if they don't power up, or if the first one doesn't power up, none of them are going to. Let's see. If they could charge up individually, you wouldn't be able to use. Yeah, that's true. Alright, that should take him out, I think. Yeah, okay, good. Okay, well, so much for my dastardly plans, then. Alright, refresh with you, and then we're going to have to use out of sight on this one. Because I'm not going to be able to get that one down enough HP to where I would be able to not die, basically. Alright, so please, hide me. Appreciate it, madam. Okay... And you're powering up yet again. Okay, that's curious. Alright. I think we should be able to take you out in time, though, because you don't have that much health to you. Yeah, there we go. Good. And we got double the... <laughs> oh, good lord. That's 24, guys. That is insane! Thinking about making a blog page for miscellaneous 
gaming topics and reviews. Oh, okay. What, um, what prompts that, if you don't mind me asking? Let's see. There's something really satisfying for Goombas flying off the screen. I know, right? Okay. We should be getting close to, hopefully, at least an in-between area here. Oh, okay, well, we got a save point anyway. Uh, is there anywhere to heal, I wonder? I guess not. Oh, okay, interesting. Okay, let's see. Alright. Go ahead and save here. And I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap things up for today, because it's getting close to the two hours anyway. So, uh, tomorrow night, when we play Paper Mario again, we will go into the Invincible... Uh, master, or not master, the invincible Tubba Blubba's place, and see if we can figure out what makes him not so invincible. So, thank you guys for coming in. I appreciate you all tuning in, as always, of course. Uh, thanks to those who uh, were our new followers today. And I will be, of course, streaming again tomorrow night at 5 p.m. Central, and then we'll be back with Final Fantasy V on Tuesdays at 3. So, thank you guys for coming in, and I'll see y'all later.